Hi, this is Scott from Whiskey and Sunshine, Off Grid. We're here today to talk about something a little bit interesting that we don't usually talk about. We're going to talk about lights. Specifically, we're going to talk about 12 volt LED lights like you'd put on equipment or like on uh, auxiliary lights on a tractor or on a four wheeler. Um, I believe they're too bright to be used on road, so I'm going to say they're off road like utility lights. Because if nothing else, they are bright. So that being said, we got this nice little box in the mail the other day from this company called Prime Locks. And they wanted us to, to try out some of their products. So they sent us uh, two of these, well, they're almost three inch square LED lights. Uh, a set of three inch round LEDs. Oh yeah. And then uh, I guess we got one big, one big giant LED square one. That would make a really nice rear light or a boom light or something like that on a tractor. But I am betting they're very bright. I don't know. I haven't tried them yet. All I can tell you is what they're rated. And um, they look to me to be rated probably average, I'd say four to five times lighter than what a regular incandescent backup light would be. So these things are very, very efficient. And like I said, basically anything that is a 12 volt charging system, these would be suitable for. Your only uh, downside to it was that the, they might be too bright uh, to be used on the road. But if you're like us and you're out here in the woods, lights are important. I, uh, I work nights, so I'm used to having lights on all of our machinery at work. And it's great when they work, and the brighter they are, the better. Here around the house, even when I'm off, most of our snow removal and stuff that needs to be done, is a lot of it is done at night. So the better we can see, the better all-around experience we have. But... Um, Anyway, they were nice enough to send us these lights, so we got the, uh, the big square one, which I, that's my personal favorite. And then these are the, this is the smaller, the uh, round, three inch. Basically, same idea, they all come with mounting hardware, and they got a, a nice little uh, wire and harness on them, so it gives you... Uh, 20 inches or so, a really nice wire, heavy gauge. Same can be said for the, the big one. And these these lights, yeah, these lights all come, these small ones all come in a two-pack. And I can't remember exactly what the price was on them. Maybe my assistant knows. <laughs> They're around $40. They were around $40, under, under. under $40 mm -hmm. a set. And that's with all the mounting hardware and you get, like I said, about 16 to 20 inches of, uh, of wiring. So there's the uh, round ones. We'll take a look at these 2.8 inch square ones. Essentially, they appear to be pretty much the same light as the round one, except uh, maybe they're spread out a little different. Looks like the wattage is the same, so I'm going to guess probably... It's going to depend on the space you have available. But these are the three types of lights we have that we're going to try. And typically what they would be replacing would be the old style rubber mounted light like this. Uh, this old light is basically what you would have found on every dump truck or farm tractor or backhoe or excavator, a dozer, anything like that. For the last 40, 50 years... Uh, they run on 12 volt. It's just a regular seal beam incandescent halogen light. I mean, they're halogen, the newer ones, but they're, they're still just a seal beam. So they're kind of like a kind of like a fire and forget thing. Once you put them on there and they go out, you don't change your bulb. You, for 20 bucks, you go to the store and get a new light. But that being said, $20, you're going to get about five times more light. Uh, this little square LED as you are out of this. 
This is going to give you that white or blue, if you will, really bright light. Well, this is going to be very dim and very yellow. It's better than nothing, but I'm telling you, these lights are a huge upgrade. I got some uh, wiring tools here and a switch. I'm going to mount a couple of these on a tractor, and hopefully that's going to give us a good indication of how they work. You'll be able to compare. I'll leave my regular incandescent lights on there for the time being so I can switch back and forth and you guys can see the difference between the two types of lights. And then we'll grab some of these other lights and a battery and a switch and we'll see if we can't hook them up and fire them up for you and see what kind of light they provide. I think it's going to be great. I think these are a very, uh, very low cost alternative. They're very well made and they're not expensive. They're not expensive. I don't like, you can't beat it. Can't beat it. Are they readily available? Prime Lux, I think on Amazon is the best place to find them. Um, again, you're looking at probably under $40 for a set of two. I would guess probably around the same for the big light. And I would imagine they would last for years. They seem to be very high quality, very well made. Cast aluminum or magnesium housings as opposed to cheap plastic, rubber coated plastic. 30 below, I hit that with a stick, it's going to break. That's just the way it is. These, much more rugged. So, I got some work to do. square 4 inch 42 watt or 3660 lumens LED light is waterproof. It has an adjustable bracket with hardware made of aluminum alloy with fins in the back for heat dispersion. These round 3 inch lights come in a 2 pack 5500 lumens high power cool white lights waterproof made of die cast aluminum alloy for efficient cooling and they come with an adjustable bracket with hardware. This cool 2 pack is 2.8 inches each 5500 lumens with high power cool white lights. Die cast aluminum alloy for efficient cooling in the back. They are waterproof and they come with adjustable bracket and hardware. We'll leave a link down in the description for Amazon and any discounts that we may have in purchasing these lights. Thanks for watching.